If you're searching for a way to heal, stay tuned because I will share the four methods that has helped me in my healing journey. Okay? But first, if you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Christine and I'm a vocal coach and I'm passionate about helping you to find ways for you to heal. I remember a time when I felt very anxious, like I couldn't really breathe properly. And one time when I was driving, the angst just flew over me. And I was fortunately with a friend and she took over because I had to stop by the road at the highway. I don't know if you've ever had that feeling. And uh, I knew at that time that I needed to change and I had to find a way to heal. Because at that time I was 22 and I didn't want to bring on that anxiousness onto my future children. So the first step I did, I went to a craniosacral therapist. I had no idea actually what a craniosacral therapist did. I went for many sessions and one day I could feel this rush coming, the lower part of my spine, rushing all the way out to my hands. And through my hands, I could feel the energy. And up to that point, I was the one that was thinking like, um, yes, that doesn't sound really true that someone can feel energy in their hands or anything alternative or spiritual. I was like, mm. Not for me, but then at that moment, I had had the experience of energy flowing through my hands. Even the therapist, she said, can you feel this? I could feel how her hands were cutting through that energy. So I just had to accept it from that moment. And it led me to be curious about Reiki. And I took the course of Reiki, three courses actually, and on one of the courses, the instructor, she said, you are, are going to be a very powerful healer through sound. And at that time I was thinking like, yeah, I've always been singing, but okay. I don't know what to do with that right now. So it was just there with me. You are a powerful healer through sound. And then it took me years to even try to grasp what that meant but then one day when I was waiting for my second child to be born it came again when I was looking to find ways to create create a better life for myself it came again the thought you will be a very good healer through sound and um, I started a project I started making 30 songs for 30 days and one song that came out of that was Thank You for the Moment, which I'm going to share with you now. You bring me so much joy. So loving you is the most I 
I can do Loving you is all that I want to do My soul was looking in the right moment at the right time you came into my life and turned me upside down yeah you turned me upside down loving you is the most I can do loving you is all that I want to do Now, after sharing this song with a group, a lady contacted me and she said she really connected with my voice and she wanted me to teach her how to sing. At that point, I had not been promoting myself as a vocal coach or nothing. She just came to me and asked, can you help me to sing? And I said, yes, I can. And she wanted to learn how to sing because she wanted to and be able to sing with her children and inspire her children to sing. So we had a few sessions and what I noticed quickly was that her main uh, pain point of singing was just to open up her mouth. So slowly but surely she opened up her mouth more and more and more and more and she went from to ah and when she was at ah our journey together was complete and our last session was not about singing it was about how she had spoken from her heart to her husband about things that needed to change you have stayed tuned through all this journey that I shared with you now here are my four amazing healing methods. The first one is craniosacral, then Reiki, then family constellation, and then sound. Each one of these therapies are super healing in itself. And if you feel like you're stuck in your life and it, your life is not moving, you're not in the right place where you want to be in your life, I highly, highly, highly recommend either one of these therapies. The one that I can help you with is to heal through your voice. The way I do it, I use classical vocal techniques and then we connect it to the spiritual aspect of the voice. If you are interested in learning more about that, stay tuned on this channel because every week I share ways of healing the voice. If you like to communicate with me directly, I go online on my Instagram account, The Power of Your Voice, every Monday at 9 p.m. There we share everything that's connected with the voice and the healing of the voice and you can come with your questions and I... We can explore your questions. I don't know all the answers. I'm just a very, very passionate student of the voice and the healing potential of the voice. So if you like this content, please subscribe so we can reach more people, so they can open up their voice and we heal the world. <laughs> and then like it, because that's also helpful. And leave a comment. All these things will make this reach more people. Okay, so see you next time. Bye.